really wish this world had the Gimmered 4 Vertical Rails module in it. Well, now it does. Just going to change my game rule to uh, command block output false. So, hello everybody and welcome to an announcement video. Uh, I would like to tell you about um, game mode for one click. So this is a system that I've uh, just rolled out to the majority of the game mode 4 modules, um, which allows you to copy some code from the game mode 4 website, which has been created, paste it into a single command block, push a button, and the module will be installed underground. So if we just go into game mode 3 a second, uh, you can go down here and you will see that the module is down here. So uh, it's pretty flush with the ground <laughs> but it's been installed um, down under here um, nice and tidy uh, some of the modules come in a bedrock box there is a character limit on the command blocks though so some of them are not in a bedrock box so if you're worried about players you might want to go down and check that it's in a box and put it in a box if you need it to be so let me just show you this again with a glass floor so you can see what's happening here we go, so I've quickly set a, a chunk to be filled with glass, it's glass all the way down to bedrock, <laughs> there's a bat stuck in the glass, and um, the way that this works I'll show it to you now. So uh, when you put down your command block, um, the structure is always summoned uh, in the northeast to the, to the uh, command block, so it'll be over here, uh, you can see on the F3 screen northeast. Um, so that's this will be the the bottom corner of that module uh, when you power this um, There's a filter which allows me to create all of this code which we paste in here Which you can get from the game mode 4 website uh, the filter wasn't created by me. It was modified by me slightly It was originally made by gentle giant Zephonies, I think it's pronounced uh, and there's also some code from Seth bling and crushed pixel in there. So um there will be links in the description. Um, the filter is not being released right now, though the modified version I have because it's kind of butchered and not particularly easy to use. Um, so yeah, if I press this button, we're going to see a load of uh, command blocks and command block minecarts appear over there. And then down at the bottom of this chunk, you can see uh, we have the filter has been installed. The clock is running. It's ready to go. Uh, and you literally, you can just push the button and play. Now you'll notice there's no bedrock box around this. Some of the modules are too large for the character limit of a command block. Uh, and in those instances, I've set it so that they do not have a box around them. Um, you may want to change that if this is on a multiplayer server and you want to protect the redstone, but otherwise, you know, you can just click and forget about it. So this is my other announcement. Here we have the brand spanking new game mode 4 website, which I've been working on. And you can use it to get a full comprehensive list of all of the Game Mode 4 modules currently released. Uh, you can click on any of these and they will take you through. So the ones with the little um, one block icon underneath the plus sign uh, are supporting the one block module system. So let's click on back grenades, for example, uh, and you will get your module information. You get the sort of the lag level you might expect from installing this in your world. A bit of a description. There's world download, schematic download, and the one click. So if I click on the one click, I'm going to get a text box and I can copy and paste all of this information. So I've copied this now. Let's go back to Minecraft. All right, we're back in Minecraft. Uh, we want to make sure that we don't overwrite uh, the existing modules because it will delete anything that was already stood there. So let's put it about here. It's probably safe. Uh, paste our code in our new code for the back grenades module, push the button, and there we go, our bedrock box has been installed, uh, and if we head over to this conveniently trapped bat, I honestly didn't plan this, he should explode because that module has been installed. Fantastic. I love this, I'm very excited with the one-click system, uh, I think it's going to make Game Mode 4 incredibly easy to access and use, and really easy for people to install. There will be a full tutorial coming out, exactly how to install this, how to turn cheats on in survival worlds, that kind of thing uh, coming out at some point. I don't know if I'll release it or just make it private, but it will be available on the Game Mode 4 website shortly. So hopefully people will find this useful, um, because I'm really happy with it. And leave feedback, see what you think. And I'll see you next time. Bye.